Where have you been? You are late. Oh well. I suppose you're here now. Sit down and be quiet. I've been thinking about Mary. I loved her. Well, we all did. And some of the things she got up to. One day, we're walking up the high street and you never guess what, she went into the cake shop and she stole a cake. And she ate it all in front of the shopkeeper. We found it funny, but he didn't. He got so angry that he chased us down the street. Oh, I'm getting ahead of myself. Do you want a cup of tea? Do you want a cup of tea? Yeah. I love <laughs> OK. Do you want sugar with it? How many? There you go. Do you want a cracker? Mm, yes, please. Thank you. Of course you can. Uh, <laughs> um, you got crumbs all over your face. Do you want a napkin? I yes, please. I will. Uh, <laughs> I suppose you two can have two napkins. So there could be two in there. Do you want to have a look? Yeah. <laughs> Hello, it's me, Ada Chapman. What? Hey. hey. Um, do you want a, a biscuit for... fell on the floor. Biscuit, Tim. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Can I open it? Of course you can. A lovely biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> I tricked you. I tricked you. You did trick me, but it's still a lovely biscuit. I love it. Can I keep it? Of course you can. Do you want a chocolate? There you go. If you, that's it. What is that? Yeah. Can you please put the train together? I used to own a bird shop and my dad started with just two canaries and in the end we had all sorts of exotic birds, beautiful they were and we had a circus too. People weren't friendly when we first arrived, who can blame them? Till the war came and the bombs hit, we knew we had to leave. So we packed our bags and we walked. Yes, we walked, waddled and stomped all the way from Birmingham, all the way to Suckley. Wow. People weren't friendly when we first arrived. Who can blame them? <sighs> we always get into sorts, sorts of trouble. With too much noise and the washing went missing. And slow, and I think the pub visits made a huge difference. The publican gave Bear beer with the ladle, with <laughs> not too many holes in. On Christmas night was this. Saddest thing, Mary died, and we had to dig a hole, but the hole wasn't big enough, so we had to cut her leg off. 
I'm going to bury it somewhere else. That's awful. I know. Yeah. But they came. People from the village. That's nice. They brought gifts for Mary oh. and they dropped them in the grave. <laughs> and we knew for sure we were accepted on one winter's night when Mary died, she was the best <laughs> elephant <laughs> you could ever wish to meet. <laughs> Crafty. And that is a true story. That is a true That's story. So good. <laughs>